G'day my friends, Marty Wee here from Marty's Garden. So how do avocados protect and take care of their fruit? That's what this video is about guys. Let's have a look at this avocado tree so you can find out some really cool stuff about it. If you can hear a noise in the background, I'm not sure if it's picking up on the microphone. It's my air garden and it's growing these vertical plants in my small space here at Marty's Garden. That's really cool. So if you like something like that, I'm going to leave a link up above and you can check out all the vlogs about the air garden. But today, this one's about the avocado. And as you can see all this new flush here, what happens is, is avocado trees like to protect their fruit and hide their fruit from the elements. You see, avos, they're a rainforest tree and they live on the verges of the outside canopy and so they can get enough sunlight to fruit but they don't like a lot of sunlight against their branches on their leaves they do and on their stems and on their fruit because they're susceptible to sunburn and if the plant loses its fruit then it can't reproduce and grow more trees right like everything's about producing a fruit some type of seed and nut so it can reproduce right avocados are just the same just we get a beautiful luscious tasty creamy fruit from it that we can eat this jam-packed full of vitamins now underneath this layer of new branches new flush that's coming through the leaves have set well not the leaves have set the flowers have set underneath and there's little fruits here and they'll thin themselves out over time but i'll give you a look at some underneath hopefully the camera will pick it up it's hiding it from the sun and from the elements and from pests and birds and different things see this little fruit here hanging underneath the canopy that's what they do, right? You can see even there's a little bit of a black spot on here not showing up on the camera, but that's a tiny little bit of sunburn when the sun would have hit it before it got protected from all these leaves that are covering from above. So you can see even more underneath this canopy here, all around these tips here. Now eventually, if the tree can't handle it, it will thin out these and only keep the ones it's got. But I've got about one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, just in that little space there. You can see a bigger one here at the top of the canopy and that's he's got a little bit burnt you can see the blackening there but eventually that leaf there will grow up and it'll cover that one and that it'll heal itself it'll just grow new skin over the top like look how beautiful this tree is really like it's so stunning all that new red flush and i just really love this tree and i really believe it's going to produce hard this season See all that new flush coming through at the top? Well, it's going to have to all be pruned back. The whole branch, like if we go back down to the bottom here, the whole branch, so we'll start from the bottom and go up and over. The whole branch is like bending over, and that's been from those heavy winds and things. And the sap always goes to the top, so these new flushes are going up here all along the top of this rim of the branch. So I've got to decide how I'm going to prune this tree yet. I'm not sure exactly how I'm going to do it, but you just have to keep an eye from the vlogs. And if you like seeing more bad avocado trees, let me know in the comments box down below, down there, guys. So dwarf avocado trees, they're just unreal for small spaces. And this one's only around about just under five feet. I'm only a little bloke, but it's going out wider than it actually is tall. Now, if you're growing a small space avocado like this, expect after about year three if you take good care of it to be super productive the fruits that you get to eat off these are just absolutely amazing i don't think you can get it even better anyway let me know in the comments box down below if you're loving this small space gardening stuff fruit trees vertical gardening anything to do with growing food at home let me know in the comments box down below i love hearing from you have a great day happy gardening and we'll see you at the next video real soon Bye for now.